The Allen County Sheriff's Department has a new fitness and training facility. Sheriff David Gladio started working on that project in 2016, and today they showed off the completed project. Wayne 15 Sierra Tufts joins us live now in the newsroom with more. Sierra? Dirk and Tara, not only is this an added benefit for the employees at the Sheriff's Department, but for the community, a vacant building is breathing new life. The 66,000 square foot facility on Venture Lane was the former Northeast Juvenile Correction Facility, but it sat empty since 2010. Sheriff Gladio says in total, the project cost about 100 and, excuse me, $15,000. It was paid, I'm going to correct myself right there, it's $150,000. It was paid by commissary profits from selling items to inmates in the jail. The facility will be available 24-7 to over 300 employees at the Sheriff's Department. In the corner is a memorial to the fallen heroes of the Sheriff's Department. Those panels that you see on the wall, the sound panels, those pictures are actually sound panels as well. And uh, so is the Sheriff's Star up there and all those other stars and, and patches and stuff. But, uh, you know, I've, I've, I, I knew each one of those guys personally. Uh, very good friends with, with, with Eric Heck and uh, uh, it's just another way to pay tribute to my buddies, and uh, uh, it's just something pretty special. Yeah, I just thought I would add that into the, you know, maybe give these guys an idea of why they're working out, you know. Sheriff Gladio says the facility wouldn't have been possible without Allen County Council and local businesses. The facility is adjoined to the future Allen County Work Release Program that's expected to open later this summer. Live in the newsroom, Sierra Tufts, Wayne 15 News. Sierra, thank you.